Hello everyone, how you doing today? I am going to be doing do-it-yourself butterflies. These are also magnets and they're 3D so you, I'm going to be putting the sticky on the back where I'm pointing and I'm going to actually be putting these on my wall. You can either have it a straight butterfly like just flat or you can put it like in maybe your fridge or a magnet box or something but this is the package that came and it's got you know several different designs and colors it looks like it's very amazing like they're all really pretty butterflies but I'm gonna be putting like most of these on the wall and I'm just gonna be folding them but right here I'm going to be putting the sticky part on this black uh, little part in the back and like I said you can put it on anything like straight or you can fold it over I'm gonna be doing uh, the folded over technique here like so and then I'm going to be like just this sticky thing right here like if you can see it the circle little sticky so I just simply am just peeling it off of the paper it either comes off the paper or the plastic so you know in this case I'm actually trying really hard to get it off but it didn't want to cooperate with me but I actually got it off so it looks like it came on the paper this time so what I'm going to do is um, just fold it over so it looks like you know an actual butterfly and I'm going to put this glue sticky stuff like so and you know press it firmly on there make sure I get it all on there and like what I did is I was pressing around the whole body of it so that way it could you know peel off its stick really well so I'm just doing this pretty firmly that I, I didn't know if he was gonna stick or not so now I'm gonna be peeling it off to make sure that it's stuck on there which it did yay so it's gonna look perfect so now that it is on the back of the butterfly it is ready to stick up and there I go f flying it around <laughs> And I'm going to be putting that one down and then uh, starting off with the next one. And I'm going to do the same thing, the folding over the butterfly technique. And also going to be repeating the step one part. I'm going to be uh, doing the same thing as step one. I'm going to be peeling off the you know plastic from the paper and this time it came with the plastic so I'm going to take this sticky and do the same thing as the first butterfly and I'm going to stick it on to the back of the black part uh, just do it like so and make sure it's really on there and excuse my nails I haven't done them yet and I wanted to make sure everybody can see this so I had this on a flashlight well you know what I mean like when you put the video recording you got it on a flash but now that I am taking this off yeah I kind of slipped there for a second yeah, I really wanted to make sure that I was on because I slipped. So that is on. Folding it over, make sure it's, you know, flappy. Because I want it to be flappy. And so now I'm just taking all of the butterflies out. Because I didn't really just want to keep going one by one. I just wanted to show the pretty butterfly here see how many different designs there are that one looks like eyes I love like the pretty colors and how it's 3d it's just amazing so I'm going to be you know placing the butterflies on different areas it's pretty awesome 
it's dancing butterfly and here is the finished product see how i said that you can put it on like magnet this is my vault box uh it's a magnet and you can see that i am pulling it away showing you and it just goes right on like a magnet a pretty box now i absolutely love it and so now that i've got all the sticky on the back of the butterflies i'm gonna go ahead and start putting them up and i'm choosing the wall so i'm gonna put it up on the wall and that is actually a picture of me with J jillian anderson from the x files and my son so i'm gonna put this underneath my csi diploma and on top of the jillian picture which i got from comic con that was a crazy night or crazy day met Nick Carter and AJ McLean, Jillian Anderson, um, the guy that plays Skinner, I keep forgetting his name, the guy that plays the smoker guy, but you know, it was just a fun filled day and I can't believe that I actually met them. So now that I'm doing number the second butterfly, showing you how it's like nice and firm, I was thinking of putting it there, but then it was... I didn't want it to be like too crushed so I decided to put it up here next to the certificate and I'm pressing really really firmly uh, because I didn't want it to fall or anything I just wanted to make sure that it was gonna stick and these are very very cute I love them so now that I got that up I am now working on butterfly number three making sure that they are all pressed up firmly and yeah I'm pushing it pretty hard uh, my thumb kind of hurts a little bit but it's all good here's number four underneath my goosebumps uh, movie poster I love that movie because I just love goosebumps R.L. Stein, anything like that I'm just a horror fanatic. Love it. And I'm really trying to press on in this. I'm thinking of painting my wall turquoise because I just hate this color. Here's the other butterfly. And you can probably notice that I am putting this in an upward pattern. Like I'm putting it in the corner of my wall just uh, because I think it's a pretty cute design. So I'm pressing this one in too. All of the butterflies, I want to make sure that they are all pressed really good. And I'm folding it over because I didn't want it to be too flat. So I want it to look like I had butterflies flying on my wall. So cute. This one was kind of a tricky one because it kept flattening up and I wanted to move it to the right, but it kept going to the left. So now here's a smaller butterfly. It's really cute. You can tell the difference in the size here. I just love how it's got like two different colors. Well, maybe three different colors, but it's really small and I think it's like super adorable. Because it really makes me think that it's like a real butterfly. And of course they're supposed to look like they are because it's 3D's. I don't know how it really is supposed to be 3D. But that's just what it said on the um, description. Here's a really nice cute uh, colorful butterfly that looks like it's looking at you. Got two eyes. It's like watching you. I'm not trying to scare you but you know that's just what it looks like. So now I'm going to put this upward. I kind of had a pattern going on here. I wanted to maybe try to do the left side of the wall. Uh, making the butterfly go left. And the right side of the corner. I try to turn towards the right. I'm not sure why. But I think I just wanted to do like um, a cylinder. Or you know what I mean. Like a 
going up kind of look. I'm not sure why I kept putting it to the left when I was trying to aim for the right. But I'm really, really trying firmly to press it on there and ignore the tape. I'm going to be taking it off. I actually had a picture there, but it came off. Just making sure that it stays over on the right because I don't want it to go left. It's just a design I want to try. Yeah, might as well put this one over here. And I tell you guys, I literally had to, like, push really, really hard. I'm just like that. I like to make sure that, you know, it's really on there. It's because it, I, I have a pet peeve that I don't like when things fall. And here is the finished result. As you can see, the um, design that I have right here, all good. Here's the finished result. I love it. What do you guys think? This is fantastic. I love it. And I wanted to show you this, of course. It's beautiful. And have a great day. I love you guys so much, and thank you so much for watching. Bye.